Real quick, let's just compare. Right. That's what we're doing today. We're comparing. Welcome. Thanks everyone for being here. Paul here, Music Villa, Bozeman, Montana. Let me just start by saying these things are so much fun. Cool. Yeah. I'm glad you said that because <laughs> I, I really believe in these and that's why we have them made because yep. I, I agree. I think they're super cool. These are nine strings, people. We've done this before. We've, we've probably done both of these before, but mm -hmm. we just saw them both sitting there and we're like, well, let's compare the two and see if yeah. there's a difference. Is there um, a difference? I can't it's tell. It's a koa. Maybe. It's a koa and a maple. One has mm -hmm. a cutaway, one does not. But let's go back to the nine string. Yes. Why would you want a nine string and what is it? Well, what it is is the B, the G, and the D, these three strings right here are doubled like a 12 string. Yeah. Yeah. But and what that does is it leaves, you know, so I'm going to jump in. Just, ahead, I don't mean yeah, to steal no, your thunder, I, I but like we, when we've discussed this before, I, 12 strings are fun, and right. they're iconic, mm -hmm. and so many um, applications or songs, the intro is really like, yeah, that's got to be a 12 string, yeah. you know, whether it's a Boston song or Hotel right. California or whatever, uh, and you want that sound. But what is challenging for myself and some other players who don't have the super forearm grip strength, I yeah. guess, is uh, you know getting the full chord and getting it, articulated yeah. well, especially on the lower strings or when you're playing bar chords. And so yeah. the nine string, by leaving the, the your E strings on both ends and that A string as a single, you get a nice crisp bass. Right. And it's not kind of buzzy or, or right. muddled. It, you can really articulate on the low end. But you get the shimmer of the oh, paired strings yeah. where you know in the meat of the chords where you want to so yeah. that's the uh, nine strings are just and you're cool. gonna play it more i think you're gonna play it a lot more 12 string people buy a 12 string they play it on one song yeah <laughs> you know but this one you could actually especially if you're a solo guy like think if you're a or gal if you're a solo artist and you're just performing and singing yeah it would just fill it up a little bit more right it does what well, just it, it has fills it. such a distinct sound and, and what, you know, to, to what you were saying, mm -hmm. the nut width, to make this easier, it's the same nut width as a regular guitar. As a regular guitar. So it's so, not, yeah. you know, the wider with all the spacing yep. and whatnot. Because it's, it's physically, it takes strength. It yeah. takes finger strength, hand strength to be able to really yeah, you gotta, uh, get your chords cleanly on yeah. a 12 string. Yep. And I'm lazy. And, and I they're harder to, to capo. Hard. And yeah. But so these things offer this, this really wonderful uh, yeah. intermediate. And again, the clarity on those low strings. Yeah. If you're They're playing just like super a travel fun. style or finger style, it yep. really helps, I think, uh, uh, clean up you know that that portion of your your yeah. plan. But and we've got yeah, a maple. Just, yeah, we just did two different designs of it. Mm -hmm. um, you know, we can only do these in custom shops, so right. there's not a model out there that's kind of a base model that Taylor makes. So you got to go to the custom shop. So you might as well you know throw some fancy wood on them. Well, I mean, and if Paul's ordering, you know he's going to order a maple. I because, you got yeah. you know it. Well, look at it. <laughs> maple and Koa. Maple and Koa are both amazing. Yeah. So we'll let you do kind of a thing at the and end and you can kind of side. compare them. We'll see. Uh, no cutaway, no pickup on this one. We can right. install a pickup if you prefer. Right. This one that is one's got a cutaway for the ES shredders pickup. that need to get up top but, and yeah. the electronics so you can plug and play. Uh, but both super fun. I mean, nine strings are yeah. just fun. They are fun. Yeah. I like them. Mm -hmm. I like them a lot. I like them a lot. Yeah. Tell me about the the white nut. To me, oh, that yes. signifies it does. It's this is still uh, an X brace. An you X know? brace. Yeah, instead in of the, the V brace instead that of they the v -brace. do. Yeah, which you know I think the V brace has a lot of advantages, but yeah, on right. the X brace I, I associate it with, with a little, a little bit, bit more bit low end. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So I nice. agree. Another. Uh, yeah, another I forgot about bonus. that as well because yeah. everything they do is is V brace, but these are still able to be built with the X-Brace um, mm -hmm. since they're a custom shop and in this design. Sweet. All right. Yeah. Thanks, Quinn. You bet. Mm -hmm. 